here what you'll do is you have to match these halls of residence with the list of features that are given over here. You'll find that there are five halls, halls of residence given to us with the list of A to G, which is eight features, and we need to match them. Okay, let's see. Track 45. You will hear an accommodation officer telling students about different halls of residence. Good afternoon and welcome to Stanton University. I'm here to tell you about the various halls of residence we have available should you choose to come here. We aim to offer accommodation in halls to all first-year students and you'll find there's a good variety to choose from. First of all, there's Brown Hall, which, as you'll see, is not the most modern of buildings, but it is very popular with some students. It's got a good sense of community, some nice refurbished kitchens, and unlike the other halls, it has recently had a gym built in its basement. Another option is Blake Residence, which is built like a large house, and so everybody cooks and eats together. It has its own sectioned-off bit of private garden and is even more peaceful because this is an all-girls residence. Although, of course, boys are allowed to visit the hall and, uh, I understand, frequently take part in cooking dinner. The largest hall we have is Queen's Building, and this has been upgraded recently. The original parking area has been built on so that the hall now has a large common room, and each bedroom now has its own shower room, which many students regard as a real bonus. A further option is the Parkway Flats, which won an award for design in its day. And this building now has a preservation order on it. This has meant that only a limited amount could be done to upgrade it, and the surrounding area is important, so parking is not permitted around the flats. However, the flats do have many extra facilities, such as a special computer room, a small library, and a self-service restaurant. The cost of breakfast, lunch, and dinner is covered in the fees for this hall, so it does look a bit more expensive. The last residence we can offer you is Temple Rise, which again is slightly more expensive than other halls as the rooms are larger. This has got very lovely views across to the coast, and this more than compensates for the fact that bathrooms here are shared between six students. However, the hall has domestic staff who clean the rooms once a week, so this is perhaps an attractive option for the messier amongst you. The first one. It's a modern building. So D is not the correct answer. I'll play the audio again. G, yes, G is the correct answer. Because they said that it, it recently got a gym built, right? So gym built means that is a sports facility. Got it? Yes, that is G. Good. Now, the next one. F. Okay. Megna. C. Yes, the answer is C. How are all of you getting the same answer and that too wrong? Okay, I'll play this again. Next one. C is for third. Okay. Mm, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, yes, I think for... Yes, F was the right answer. C is the right answer for the next one. Right, right. Yes, Ankita, C is the answer for this question. Yes, yes, C is for the third one. 
Yes, all of you got C for the third one. Meghna, C is for the third one. Good. Next, the fourth one. All meals are included here. Right? Good. And the last. A. Cleaning is included and so it is for the messier one. Yes.